school in the country. Uh, got a player walking that hall. Yeah. That's better than everybody on that team. Yeah. And they never understand why they're not playing. Yeah. And yeah. it probably started, say, for like a high school kid. If you ask them, oh, well, you know, freshman year, you know, I messed up on my grades or this or that. Yeah. Well, now after you messed up on your grades, then you went to the street. So now yeah. that your whole attitude changed from wanting to be an athlete to now you want to be out here and you want to be a hot boy. Yeah. And so now the coach then got a totally different perspective of you. So now sophomore year, you don't try out. Now junior year, when, you know, you really popping, you want to play, coach ain't going to deal with you. You yep. know, senior year, you like, man, it's my last year. But then yep. well, it, it go back to, to freshman year all because of – or I've seen kids literally from elementary school. Like, oh, well, what happened? Well, I, you know, what eligible fifth grade. Mm-hmm. And then, you know, sixth grade, I got in trouble right prior to trials. Well, yep. you know, all that yep. goes hand in hand. So I don't necessarily – want to work with a superstar. And I have players that, you know, former players that's playing overseas, you know, that's that's played on NBA rosters. You know, I can create those players to get there. Mm-hmm. I don't necessarily need that person that think that they're a superstar, if that makes sense. No, I don't like the, them be the ones that yeah. like they think they know too much. <laughs> right. And so I tell them if I'm if you know so much, then why am I here? Like why am I here? If you <laughs> if if you know all that, why am I here? So therefore, now when we're talking about that average player that's under the radar, yeah. that has the potential to be something, but those are the players. And the reason why I do what I do. Because those are often the players, they only need a little tweak yep. in the athletic side. Yep. Yep. The biggest thing is off the court. And and with going back to that, you you know, a recruitment diagram. Yeah. That attitude, it, it, it all goes back. So I can, you know, tweak your jump shot. Or I can, you know, tweak your euro step or whatever you do to get to the basket, your ball mm-hmm. handling. We can fix that a little bit. Yeah. But that's not the reason why you's not on the team. Exactly. You know, right, we already identified that you're probably better than everybody on the team. Mm-hmm. But what else is holding you back from the team? And my job as a coach is can I put the proper strategies in place to help yeah. you understand and get it there yeah. before it's too late? Yeah.